The Chicago Bears had a padded practice today, and Matt Eberflus said it was a physical one, but the team is keeping things tight-lipped with Week 1's matchup against the Titans looming. Today was the first injury report of the season. Football is officially back. Chiefs vs. Ravens kick off the season tomorrow night, but we did get some details on everyone that was limited in practice. Let's go ahead and get right into it. The good news is that nobody completely missed practice today, but the Bears had a few players who were limited, and the guys listed on the first injury report of the season are as follows. Wide receiver Keenan Allen was limited with a heel designation. Tackle Karan Amagaji was limited with a quad. Offensive lineman Ryan Bates was limited with a shoulder injury. Roshan Johnson was limited with a toe ailment. Zach Pickens is still limited with a groin injury. And then Montez Sweat was limited with a toe designation. The first thing that's going to catch most people's eyes is seeing Keenan Allen and Montez Sweat listed. To me, I would imagine it's mostly just being cautious with veteran players. No reason to panic about either Montez or Keenan. I expect both guys to be ready to go on Sunday. My biggest concern for week one right now would be Roshan Johnson and Zach Pickens. Neither guy is a starter, but both players would be expected to get reps in this game. Roshan is likely our running back number two, and Zach Pickens is likely our first defensive tackle that rotates in off the bench. If Roshan is out, we could see Khalil Herbert or even Valus Jones Jr. get a couple of reps in this game. Keep an eye out for that. Meanwhile, with Zach Pickens' week one status in question, the Bears are expected to call up new practice squad defensive tackle Sam Roberts. That's something to keep an eye out over the next couple of days. But as for the Titans, they seem to be entering week one pretty healthy. DeAndre Hopkins has returned to practice. He was limited today, but videos on Twitter showed him running routes and looking pretty good. DeHop seems like he should be ready to go on Sunday. The Titans did have safety Jamal Adams miss practice, but if you didn't know, the former Pro Bowl safety is not a starter for the Titans. He's a backup safety. But it's finally here, guys. Week 1 is right around the corner. I'll have a full preview of the game out soon. But a couple of things to remember heading into this game. The Titans have a new head coach, a first-year coach taking on Matt Eberflus, who's entering year 3. But they do have a lot of talent on the roster. But also, let's remember that number 1 picks at quarterback have not fared well in their first career starts, going 0 for 15. Can Caleb Williams break the curse? If anyone can do it, it's him and this Bears team assembled by Ryan Poles. Stay tuned, guys. Let me know how you're feeling heading into week one. I have a ton of content on the way. Please remember to hit that like button for me. And until next time, bear down.